Hello YouTube, this is Ryan from Ryan's Journey coming at you with a quick update. Um, still alive and kicking, doing well. Just got off work, it is New Year's Eve, so I want to wish all of you a happy New Year's. I'm sure you guys are all going to enjoy it one way or another tonight. Um, I got off early today at 2, and um, so I'm happy about that, and off tomorrow. So that's always a positive, and um, plan on having a little bit of fun, meeting up with some friends, etc. So looking forward to it. And now as far as numbers go, I... Um, I started my journey on November 18th, 2013. That's when I first met my surgeon. I was at my highest weight of 326 pounds. Three months later, I was at 294 pounds, a loss of 32 pounds. Um, I had surgery about 10 months ago. That was February 24th. And, you know, today's New Year's Eve. So you can do the math. And, um, and I don't have a scale at my new place yet, but I did happen to be at a place where I had access to a scale very similar to mine, a digital scale. And I came in there a few days ago at 198.8. So that's cool, I'm in Wonderland. Yay, exciting. Um, I wasn't sure if I wanted to really get into Wonderland too much and, or if it was gonna happen, and um, it did. So I'm officially in Wonderland. I had to plan on not losing very much more. I wanna stay at 200, give or take, five pounds. Um, so excited about that, so. But really just uh, wanted to touch base on, so if you, if you think about the numbers, I think it's about total loss since the start of my journey at 127, 128 pounds since surgery, minus 32 off of that. So, so great losses, it's changed my health around. I really haven't, haven't had really side effects very much, you know, some throwing up occasionally early on, some constipation early on for all you new people out there. But though you work through those, you get past those. Um, Medications, all my blood tests are great. You know, I don't take any medications. I don't do CPAP machines or BiPAP machines for my sleep apnea anymore. That's great. Um, I do take a pill that's a Prilos, generic Prilosec. I forget what it's called. Uh, you guys know it's a very common name. It starts with O, I think. Um, once a day. And I know if I don't if I don't take that every day, like if it goes a couple of days, I start feeling a little heartburn. So that has been a side effect. And as long as I take the pill every day, I'm pretty much fine. But you know, my doc, my surgeon doesn't want me to let too much stomach acid build up and those kind of things so so I'm just gonna keep taking the pill and, and hopefully eventually we're hoping we can get off of that but but that is one thing that I do take and I didn't have really issues with that before surgery so that's something noteworthy and um, but, but really that's all I got I just wanted to pop in real quick wish everybody a happy new year talk about my exciting time dipping into Wonderland for a bit here and um, I hope you guys all have a great time tonight and have fun be safe all right, thanks.